In this video, you will learn how to generate this timeline chart in Microsoft Excel. You can see here I have generated this chart using this set of data. First column shows the date, second one shows the main activity of the project and third one shows the values and these values are indicated by this length of this line. If you uh, increase this value, then the length of this line will be increased. And if these are positive value, it will be displayed on the upper side of the line. And if these are negative values, this will be displayed on the lower side. There is no specific rule for these values. You can enter any value according to your convenience. So let's move to next sheet. If this video is helpful for you then please like this video and subscribe our channel for more informative videos. In a separate sheet I have already entered the data from previous sheet. So firstly click any blank cell and go to insert option. In insert option you will find the option of charts and go to this insert column or bar chart option and select first one to enter a blank chart. After that right click go to select data option you will find two options first one is the legend entries and second one horizontal axis in legend entries click add firstly series name left it blank and in series values remove existing values and select the data regarding positions Remember, don't select the, this title only, these values. Click OK. Then in horizontal axis, click edit. Axis label range, click date. And again, click on OK. Then again, OK. Now we have successfully generated this graph. Resize it using these handles now you can see here here you will find the option of chart elements click here and from here i will select check the data label option and i will uncheck grid lines secondly you will find the option of error bars check here and click on this arrow button and from here you can go to more options in more options vertical error bars i will select minus and with no cap In percentage, select this percentage option and write 100%. Now go to fill and line option and select their color red and adjust their width to. 3PT. Scroll down and here you will find the option of begin arrow type. You can select this one. Sorry. You, I will select this one and end arrow type I will select this one. Now click on these bars. You can see here the bars are selected and in fill and line option I will select go to fill option first and select no fill. Secondly in border option I will select no line. Now you can see here that the bars are disappeared now click on this y-axis app option and press backscape or delete button to remove this 
after that click on any data label you can see here all data labels are selected right click go to format data label option and from here you will find the option of values from cell click here and select the data label range which is the activity click here click on ok now i don't want these values so i will uncheck this option and i also don't want ladder lines so i will also uncheck this option now click anywhere here you can see here that their labels are changed now go to chart title click here put equal sign and select any cell which contain the title and press enter you can also manually write this one change their font size to 20 and bold change their color to black next uh, click on this y-axis line right click go to format axis option and here you will you will find the option of this axis option scroll down go to tick marks option and in tick marks option you can select major type outside and minor type outside now go to fill and line option from here you can select the color i will select red and you can change the width 3 pt scroll down and from here you can select begin arrow type and end arrow type in end arrow type i will select this one Now you can also change the font size, bold them and select 12, change their color to dark black. Similarly click on any data label and you can adjust their font size and color. Now we have successfully generated this timeline chat. That's the end of this video. Thanks for watching this video. Goodbye.